Round three of the Rockstar Energy Arena Cross Series from Calgary, Alberta. Starting the night with a clash for cash. Cole Thompson would grab the Royal Distributing Hole Shot, but Mike Brown would power his way around the outside. The lead wouldn't last as he made way for the charging red-plated number 16. The 46-year-old Brown would hold tight from there, keeping the two ex-national champs in his rearview mirror. At the finish line, it was Cole Thompson, Mike Brown, Matt Gerke, Colton Fasciati, and 250 rider Sean Maffenbeier. Two hundred and fifty Pro main event as Dylan Wright was soldiering through an upper body injury to be Brad Nottick grabbing the Royal Distributing Hole Shot, but it would not take long for the 2017 national champ Sean Maffenbeier to power his way to the lead. Sean would make things look easy as he took the number three machine to a healthy gap. The battle would heat up between veteran U.S. rider Brad Nottick and rookie sensation Marco Canella as the two riders would play cat and mouse for the 15 lap main event. Canelo would try everything in his power to grab that second spot, but the crafty American would get the last say as his smooth, precise riding would reign superior. In the end, it was Sean Maffenbeier, Brad Nottett, Marco Canelo. Sean would carry a healthy points lead into round four of the series heading to Sarnia, Ontario. The last race of the night 450 Pro main event, and with another Royal distributing hole shot for the number 16 Cole Thompson, he would jump out to the early lead with Colton Fasciati in tow. The race would be cut short and restarted due to down rider Davey Fraser. Davey would get up under his own power but would not be able to restart the race. The second start would see a major mix up as three riders came across the first rhythm together. It was the number five Tyler Medaglia that had suffered an early crash and the riders would get shuffled up quickly. It was FXR rider Mike Brown that led the way until the hard charging KTM of Cole Thompson would grab onto the lead. Thompson would create a gap instantly and not look back. Mike Brown was holding tight onto the second spot for majority of the 20 lap main event before giving way to last year's 450 champ Matt Gerke and his OTS FF Yamaha. Mike Brown would continue to get moved back as the GDR Honda number 45 machine Colton Fasciati was on a mission to limit the damage of his early lap troubles. Once around Brown, Fasciati would set his sights on the Yamaha rider of Gerke. With Cole Thompson taking his second main event win, it would be Colton Fasciati with his never say die attitude making a last lap pass for the second spot. Thompson and Fasciati will remain tight with a narrow lead for the KTM rider heading to Sarnia, Ontario.